to my channel thank you so much for being here and watching today's video how are you guys doing happy Day whenever you're watching this. In today's video, I'm sure you've guessed from the title, I'm doing a part two wedding guest outfit try on. I do want to start by resharing this dress from House of CB. It like it's the dress that I'm gonna wear, I think. I've come to the conclusion, although I may share these dresses in this video and then you guys will be like, no, India, you're wrong. You need to go for that one because these dresses are chef's kiss, stunning. So Anyway, this dress from House of, C House of CB, I just love so, so much. It is absolutely stunning. And just like the quality, the shape, the fit, the pockets, I just adore and I just feel really comfortable in it. And I think that's so important when you're going to a wedding and you're sitting down and you're dancing and all of that, you want to feel comfortable in the dress or the suit that you're wearing. And this, I just think is an absolute dream. So just resharing that in case you guys didn't see it in my part one video, because I think it's super, super special. We're gonna start with dresses from ASOS. So I did like another little order on there of like a few dresses that some of them are for like different kind of holiday wedding guests or like special occasions. These could kind of be tailored for like graduations, for proms, for grad balls, depending on the occasion, like, that's quite dressy. I feel like these will work for most of them. So starting with this really beautiful navy, it's like this beautiful satin cotton material, like the quality of this is insane. And I kind of wish I had a grad ball or my prom again, <laughs> because I would have loved to have worn this. My friend's actually a medic and I went back in the day, like years ago, went to her Leeds grad medic ball and this would have been perfect. So I feel like this would be good for that kind of thing if you're at uni and you've got that kind of thing coming up or if you've got a prom, I just think it's absolutely stunning. I am slightly short for it, I will say that. I was only wearing two inch heels underneath the dress but it's got a long beautiful train and I think I'd probably go for like six inch heels if I was wearing this one. But again, the back detail, the quality, it's giving like, yeah 10 out of 10 from me then next i saw this colorful fun print one which i feel like is still in stock it keeps going in and out of stock in the smaller sizes but again i'll leave everything linked down below for you guys but the holiday the holiday the wedding i shouldn't say holiday the wedding i have coming up in september is abroad and she has a pre-wedding like dinner happening and the kind of theme is go fun and colorful it's like barbecue but it's also like dress up a little bit so i thought this would be perfect for that it's very me i love all the, like the pinks and oranges and i thought with the espadrilles this would be quite nice and then if you had an abroad wedding in like italy you could easily add like a blazer with this and it could be a bit more fun as well and you could go with a point toe hill but i just loved this and it's a linen blend so perfect for like 30 degree heat that i'm going to be going to next dress was a little bit different for me in terms of colors but i love top shop and always have i mean i'm an og i used to work there <laughs> OG Topshop lover but I love the satin dresses that they do and I know that they're good quality and I know that they fit and I know they don't do that weird like side seam bunchy up thing that they sometimes do and I saw the colour of this one and I actually thought for autumn winter weddings and summer weddings or spring weddings or even just occasions this would be perfect and I'd also wear it in autumn and winter if I had a night out with my girls with my Dot Martins and a chunky black and gold belt and maybe a fake leather jacket. There's also like ways that you could wear it for not only special occasions where it's a bit more dressed up, which is why I loved it so much. Then next, this yellow dress, which I believe is, I mean, I posted this on my TikTok and a lot of you were saying that's more of a white yellow and that I'd need to check with the bride. However, I love it. I love it so much. I mean, I obviously would check with the bride. This was a runner up for me and kind of still is because I just love the shape of it. And I love wearing yellow and pinks at the moment. and. Again, just really beautiful quality. It's like a soft structured material, like a scuba cross cotton material. And it just feels really beautiful on. I tried it on with my point toe shoes and then I did put my six inch platform white heels on and it kind of is the perfect length for me if I was wearing six inch heels. So potentially I wouldn't even need it taken in if I did end up going for that. But I just thought this one was beautiful and I love the like side asymmetric shoulder detailing to this. Now lilac, I feel like is the color of the season right now. And I'm loving pinks, lilacs, yellows, all of that. And when I saw this, I wasn't really sure how it would personally fit me on, but I love the detailing to this. I feel like it's quite different, but also quite elegant, quite beautiful, would work for like winter weddings, of blazers summer weddings spring weddings and i actually really liked the back detailing to this i am wearing my stick on amazon bra here i literally swear by this like it 
changes the game when you don't potentially like me don't like wearing backless tops or dresses without a bra on and yeah they're just great i tend to have one and then use these like anti-back wipes once i've worn it because you can't wash them because then the stickiness just goes and then yeah you can kind of keep them i mean i've had mine for a year and it's still going and it's clean because you just wet wipe it and it's still sticky so they're pretty good and then next moving on to some forever new dresses so this yellow dress i again fought for like weddings abroad holidays if you're more of like a mini dress lover i feel like this one would be great for you it is a linen blend so the one thing for me which was a bit like I love it, I want to wear it, is the sitting down and it creasing. My steamer actually broke during filming this and I wasn't able to steam it. So as you guys can kind of see a little bit, it does crease slightly. However, even just a holiday dress, I thought this would be gorgeous, like girls trips, girls holiday, where you want to dress up a little bit more. Or if I go away with Jay, sometimes we do an evening when we dress up and go for something a bit more fun. So I thought this would be perfect for that. And actually maybe a potential for the day before the wedding that I've got in September, this would be probably a nice one for the barbecue because we do all want to go a bit fun and glam. Then this one, I love this one so much. I feel comfortable in it. There's adjustable straps. It's like beautiful colors. I love it with like yellow accessories. I love it with the espadrilles, just like court heels. I just think it's stunning and also really fun. And I feel like sometimes for weddings, like it's really easy to kind of sway to those like block colors or pastel colors and me being me like I'm a color girl at heart and I just feel like this one for me is definitely in my top three that I love and I think for abroad weddings and I also like the fact that this could be a holiday dress it could just be an out and about like special occasion dress if you're yeah you kind of like holidays weddings maybe even a grad ball this would be quite beautiful depending obviously if it's not black tie i probably wouldn't go for this black tie but if it was like a fun summer grad ball i potentially would go for this so yeah i love this one and the quality is just amazing now this last dress is actually a dress that i wore for my grandparents 60th wedding anniversary we had like a little party at theirs and we all got dressed up in like blazers and suits and dresses and i just thought this one was absolutely stunning i actually think this would be perfect for a christening or a baby shower or a wedding guest outfit idea if you like more of those shorter dresses as well for reference i leave all of this down below but i am five foot three so this is the length of it on me and the quality of this was my favorite i think from like the whole video like it feels very premium i love the structure it fits true to size it's just a dream and forever new honestly do such beautiful like high quality premium pieces and dresses and like such a wide option and i mean asos have so many that my wish list and my saved right now is like through the hundreds like i have so many saved so yeah i wanted to share those with you guys before hopefully any of them sell out i do think there was an added one yeah that did sell out that i didn't share in the video but i will if i have a clip of it i'll leave it on the screen it's from style cheat and they do some really beautiful dresses on asos which is where i got this one from and i love it it's super fun very different for me with the green but i yeah it hasn't it's kind of sold out and it hasn't come back in stock and they do very similar ones that have like more ruffles and a bit more fun like prints to them and patterns in block colors but yeah this one hasn't come back in stock so i'll leave it here but just in case you guys want to see that or check out style cheat on asos and there's some really beautiful ones out there but anyway thank you guys for watching i hope you're really well and i'll do a part three very soon i'm gonna have a little browse around over the next couple of months and want to make sure that i'm kind of trying on dresses that are gonna work for spring and summer mainly in part three but anyway we shall see but any requests let me know and i'll see you guys in the next video lots of love Mwah. bye